What's going on today guys? Today we have a brand new game, F1 2016 is here and I wanted to show it off, showcase it on the channel, start up the career mode, and start up a really cool series for you guys. So in this video I'm going to be using the good old fashioned Xbox One controller, but in the next part I will be using the play seat and the big old fashioned steering wheel, so stay subscribed for that. But for now, let's get into F1 2016, start up our career, and just see what we got to do. I, I will admit, I have jumped in and played a couple of races so far. I'm not very good at the game, but I do enjoy it quite a bit. I haven't done anything with the career mode so far. So let's get in, start it up, and see what we can do. So should we just go with the standard old career mode? I'm not sure what the pro career or what the difference between these are. Anyways, let's just go career. And we're going to do, let's go custom weekend. So we can sort of build what we do. We're going to go uh, expert AI. I played around a bit with that, and I apparently can do that, and we gotta build my character. I imagine none of these- yeah, none of these people have extremely long hair, so let's just choose a dude who looks cool. I love this sort of customization, it feels really good to jump in and, and pick something like this and, and like, choose everything. So now, should I go with the British roots, or should I go with the good old-fashioned Canadian? We've already got enough British drivers, we don't have any Canadian drivers, let's uh, get one of them. And for the number... Who has number 88 in F1? Number 9? Who has number 9? 13, fine. God damn it. Register details. Good. Team selection. I can choose any team. So, I mean, we've got the top tier teams. It says win the championship in one to two seasons for Mercedes, Ferrari, Williams, and Red Bull. Then we've got tier two teams. Like, we've got Force India there, Toro Rosso, Mc McLaren. And Haas, nice. So, I mean, should we take McLaren? McLaren has, has always been my favorite F1 team, but ever since they started to suck, I sort of moved over to Red Bull because I'm a big fan of Max Verstappen as well and, and Daniel Ricciardo. So, I mean, should we go with... I, I, I know I don't want to go with any of these Tier 1 teams because those are going to be the goal. But maybe we should go with McLaren and try to get them back in the running even with their shit box car. Let's make my teammate Jensen good old button. Start up the career. Let's get in. All right, what do I need to do? New contract with McLaren. I'm going to be the second driver alongside my... Oh, for God's sake, my teammates, Fernando Alonso. I meant to make it button. Okay, so I went in and I fixed that. My teammate is now Jensen Button, I think. So we've got the first race of the season. Australia, Melbourne. Let's head out there. Get on the track. Do some practice. Welcome to Melbourne, where the practice session is about to start for this weekend's Australian Grand Prix. The pre-race talking is over. Now it's time for the drivers to show their worth. Wow, that's cool. We got proper commentators. A lot of focus is naturally on the hey, uh, look who it is. Really it's the German. So, we'd like to run the acclimatization program if you have a chance before qualifying. Oh. It'll give us a good indication of our relative pace and consistency. Oh, this is how I can upgrade my car. I see. Okay. So recommended. Objective score three. I don't know how to get those. Let's just select it. Flying lap. Let's try. I don't know what we're doing, but let's just do a lap. So yeah, one of the things that you can do this year is actually upgrade your cars based on how long you drive with them and stuff like that. And you can obviously do certain objectives where you can get basically experience points and then put those experience, experience points towards your car and make it fast. So I'm not sure exactly how they work, but we'll see. After uh, we do this lap or so, our, I mean, our score is what? Three, five, three, four, five. That's so cool! That is so cool! You have to hit these, uh, Hamilton. That is really cool. It teaches you how to do the lines and everything properly and actually makes you a better driver. This is gonna be super important for someone like me, who's not particularly good, but who wants to learn and put in the time. This is gonna be so cool! Oh, this is awesome! This is so cool! I'm getting a bunch of points. Oh, balls. I usually take that really close to the here, because I find you can just sort of shorten the track a bit. I guess the game doesn't think so. Balls. Come on, I need a bit more score. 
I need a bit more score, man. Come on. It's so cool! I missed. Got it. I think it's taking into account everything. My speed I go into these at, everything. Holy shit. I did it! I got 415! Objective nice complete. You'll get a bonus for consistency if you can chain good corners together. New objective, for score 470! No! Back to the garage. So what did I get? I got 30 of 50. Cool! It says optimal, 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 DRS activated. 0 0.03 seconds late. That's so sick! So, I mean, how does our team fare compared to the others? That AMG, look how far up it is. Um, so should we go downforce? Yeah, let's go downforce. Select upgrade. Develop upgrade. See what type of time we can set with our one-shot qualifying. And let's go. All right. Let's do the best we can in this McLaren. We have upgraded the downforce, so... I mean, I don't know when that goes into effect, but, I mean, hopefully soon, right? <gasps> oh my god, I nearly absolutely binned it. Vettel, vet, 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 vet. I'm currently in, I have to, I have to get 13th place. That is my goal. Oh, wow, I have dropped back so badly. Okay, where's my split time on, on this section? 31. Ugh, my car, it keeps weaving. I do like the idea of one-shot qualifying, though, but let me know what you guys want to see. If if you guys want me to do a bigger, longer qualifying session, please let me know. I mean, I, I don't want these videos to be crazy, crazy long, though. That's the thing. That's why I want to go with the one-shot qualifying and the short practice and basically just do a lap or two and then get straight into the race. So let me know what you guys want to see. But anyways, yeah, Rosberg pulls fastest lap. My qualifying is complete, and I'm going to be starting to probably last. Yeah, last place. Let's advance. Get going with the race. I mean, I will be starting from the back of the pack, but maybe I can bomb it off the line. I don't know. We'll see. Let's start this up. One of the cool things this year is the is the manual start. And you basically got to hold the clutch off the line and let it go. And you're good to go. And you're absolutely flying off the line. I mean, provided you get a good start. I've already moved up to 21st position. I'm going to need to be careful here. I'm going to want to dive down the inside. Everyone's going to break super early. Holy crap. I could have died. I've probably got many penalties for that but that's okay 60 17th position for me right behind Gutierrez as I'm not sure how you pronounce his name he's got a very confusing name anyways just dive up the inside on a lot of these guys early on as much as possible I can keep doing that oh please don't get a penalty please don't give me a warning nothing 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 yellow flag that's fine okay I mean, off the off the line, I can sort of do that. I can dive up the inside a lot of a lot on a lot of the people, but as soon as we get into the meat of this race, that will not be possible. Oh, the whole race is 15 laps. My bad. So what am I pitting? I don't know what I'm pitting. Anyways, let's just let's just drive. The dude will tell us when we need to come in. Let's just try to drive. All right. So stuck behind Groja in 14th position. Got a guy up my butthole, trying to close the door on him as much as possible. Oh, I need that downforce, man. I tried to keep it in there. I tried to keep the power on, but the car just ran wide. Oh, and that's a bit of late braking there. Yeah, he's going to go up the inside, and fast he goes. Ericsson. All right, come on. I need to relax. I need to chill, and then I'll get a good run on these guys. Hamilton pulls in the fastest lap at a 134. We are on the super soft tires. That was from a dig, so, I mean, we'll see what type of lap times he puts in in a little bit. It doesn't seem like we're gonna get any rain this race, so we should get DRS, which should be good. Let's just, let's just go for it, man. Past Ericsson up the inside, that's good for me, but Groja has pulled. I think actually we've dropped back. Buttons ahead! Holy shit, good for him. Oh, late braking again. Where's Ericsson? Ericsson is up my butthole. My tires are dirty. I ran wide in one of the corners. It's gonna slow me down, breaking early for this one. No coming up the inside there. All right, we're gonna need to use this this early break strategy because, I mean, for everything else, I'm just breaking way too late and I'm having way, way too many issues. So break early, take it slow, but it's better to take it slow and stay on the track than it is to try to do it as fast as possible and run wide and go off the track and spin and dirty your tires and everything. 
It's just not worth it. Alright, so I'm holding my position fairly well, but I do have one hell of a truly train behind me. Trying to press on Ericsson. Or, sorry, Grosjean a bit. Ericsson's pressing on me. Ah! And I'm not even gonna get DRS. Look how far away I am from everyone. They're gonna get DRS on me. Let's have an update. Driver in front. Oh my god! Oh, what? What? Bro! What the hell was that, Ericsson? Yo, 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 yo. That's unacceptable. Look what he did. And then for whatever reason, he fucking spins me! Let's see his hands. Does he turn into me? No, a little bit. Look at that! Look at the little shit! And he tries to hold his thing, and then he crashes. Then he's like, oh, why'd he hit me? And then he's on two wheels, and he's like, oh, why? And he's a freaking 360 in the middle of an F1 race. Cheeky fuck. I'm flashbacking that, because you're a dickhead. Gutierrez. Is that how you pronounce it? Gutierrez. That, that looks right. I, I love how I'm, this is the thing that's currently going through my head. Thank you for the update. But yeah, I love how I'm focusing on people's names and not so much the race. I need the extra power! Holy shit. Had to go off the track a bit. Exceeded track limits. Pulling! Haha, <laughs> Ericsson stuffed. Oh, that was not good. So one of my main issues with F1 games always is that I just go through my tires like they're absolutely nothing. So that's something I'm going to be be wary of. That was the issue with my, my with my driving in last year's game. I just I just have a real 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 tough time controlling those tires. Do they have? No, they don't have uh, DRS. Good. What am I doing? What's my strategy? Lap four go in for softs or lap six? Let's go for lap six. I mean, I could go in now and I could get on the softs, but one, actually, how are these tires doing? Should have probably checked that first. Okay, so that's a good thing. He let me know my tires were okay. So that will that will totally allow me to go to go two more laps essentially and then get the soft tires on instead of the super softs. Holy shit, he is right there. He's sticking with me through everything. We have pulled away from Ericsson a bit. But freaking Gutierrez, right on my butthole! If you can pass me, go for it, buddy. I'll get a toe off you. That'll be okay for me. I'll let you go. I let him go a bit. I, I lift it off. Okay. That's not my... How did he slow down that much? What just happened there? I have no idea what just happened there. Alright, let's see Let's see if anyone pits here. I'm not expecting anyone to, but we'll see. Oh, wow! Ericsson's past Gutierrez! None of these guys seem to go in the pits again. I don't know when the majority of these guys are going in. Probably the same as me. Wow, look at Ericsson all the way back there. They seem to drop off the pace a lot with my little move. I don't know if I bumped Gutierrez or what, but Ericsson overtook him and those guys have, whoa. Those guys have completely slowed down back there. Yeah, that was good. Oh, 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 oh. Holy shit, I nearly lost the entire car. I had to brake so hard there. Come on, holy shit, Ericsson. All right, in the pits we go. Oh, a lot of people seem to go in the pits this lap. All right. Let it do its thing. I don't want to touch it now. All right, come on, boys. Come on, boys. Make up some places. Make up some places. I'm in 18th position. All right, I seem to have a bit of open track for me. I'm going to need to heat these tires up, and then I can get into some decent laps with them. But I think my main thing is I just got to drive clean, because I drive quite quickly. I just need to drive a lot cleaner than I am right now. There we go. That was a nice line through there. Sensodyne. <laughs> I had no idea McLaren was sponsored by a toothpaste. Anyways, we'll see how many people pit here. I'm hoping it'll be a lot and there's going to be absolute chaos in the pit lane. Which will mean I'll be able to catch up to some people and hopefully overtake some. I don't know though, we'll have to see what's going on. There seem to be a couple of people in the pit, so maybe a couple extra places I can catch up here. Let's see though. 
Let's see, there's a couple people in the pit. And I should come flying past them. Good, up to 14th place. This is where I really need to clean up my lines, though, through here. I run wide a lot on that corner, and especially up here as well. Much better, much better. If I can stay like that and just stay clean and consistent, I feel like that's a lot better than just running as fast as I can and running off half the time. I mean, what, my, my objective was 13th place, so 14th place is definitely not too, too bad. Obviously, I would like to hit my objective, but I will need something to go wrong up ahead of me. Oh, oh! Guy's out the race! Holy shit, he's gonna crash behind me! Yes! Yes! Holy shit, yes, 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 yes! Holy shit, this is exactly what I needed. Alright, let's turn my fuel back down to standard. So, just in case I do need the extra fuel, I will have it. Oh god, this, this could change this entire race. What a turn of events. All right, is Hamilton gonna do a little shimmy? Is he gonna slow it down? Oh, he is slowing it down. He's slowing it way down. I'm gonna chill right here. Balls. Still, still a yellow flag. The thing went off my screen and I'm like, go! Oh, green flag, green flag, green flag. Fuck. Come on, everything! We need everything now, boys! Come on! We need to push, 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 push! Come on, catch up the signs! Catch up the signs! This is what we needed! We needed this! Don't let it go to waste! Come on, catch up the signs! Catch up the signs! It feels like... It feels like all the grip in my tires is just gone! That didn't help, driving across the grass! Come on! I had the opportunity to make something great happen, but I screwed it up. I lost him right on the restart because I tried to be a sneaky bitch, and I screwed it all up. Yeah, yeah, one lap of fuel. I'm on the last lap. See, you'll tell me that, but nothing about my tire. All right, well, you're just a bitch, Gutierrez. Hope you get a penalty for that. Uh, race winner Hamilton. Congrats, Mr. Hamilton. You're a dickhead! You're a dickhead, Gutierrez! Freaking spun me on one of the corners! I hope he gets a penalty. Please give him a penalty. Oh, I'd feel so good. Like, he actually did that. I, if he doesn't get a penalty for that, I'm doing that to people next race. Alright, let's see. Hamilton's on first. Of course, Rosberg second. And Vettel. Nice! Gutierrez did not get a penalty for that. After an excellent result. Wow. Davidson, who was your driver? Palmer DNF. I'm going to give it to the McLaren driver. There was a lot going on all down the field, but they were the only one who I really felt maximized their potential. And here's how things are shaping up. The McLaren driver. Uh-huh. That's what I like to hear. There'll be plenty more twists. So, I mean, we're in 15th place. Not brilliant. Constructors. I didn't actually see if if uh, Button was in the points, but probably not. He is a McLaren. Oh, he got ninth Button. Good for him, two points. Good job, buddy. Fastest lap, yeah, he got that. Fastest sector. Sector three, buddy, that's my place. Anyways, guys, I think that's where I'm gonna leave it for today. Hopefully you guys did enjoy this video. If you did, you can subscribe down below. Like I said, this time I was using the controller, but next time I'll be on the wheel, so that should be exciting. So thank you guys for watching. See you guys next time.